Hi, and welcome to Inside the Pack. I'm Nick Coleman. And in our first episode, we're going to be talking about the very surprising Nevada baseball team who's off to a great start so far this season. That's right. And our third member of our team, Drake Montez, caught up with one of the outfielders to discuss their magical season. As he said, this is Nick Coleman, I'm Alex Stewart, and you're watching Inside the Pack. Together this year, they're ranked 19th nationally this week. Yes, the Nevada baseball team has definitely taken a step forward, kind of out of the dark. Out of nowhere. Right? Out of, yeah, yeah, out of nowhere. You know, Nevada baseball, 19th in the nation, possible College World Series appearance. They are projected to be in the regionals. As of right now, they're projected to be in the regionals for that tournament. Yeah, and, so. you know, and that's, that's obviously very good for them, and I'm sure that those players are super excited to be a part of that and I hope that they can make the tournament just for experience and just to bring some yeah bring some good popularity to Nevada athletics because you know let's face it we want it I know everyone's excited to see you and I talk and Obviously. I'm sure it's it's riveting but we do have a third member of our team that's Drake Montez and he was actually lucky enough to secure an interview with one of the Nevada baseball players so let's throw it out to Drake Drake Thanks, Alex. I was able to speak with sophomore outfielder T.J. Friedel, and he gave us some insight into what's going on behind the scenes with Wolfpack Baseball. I think the biggest thing with our team um, for, the, for the years I've been here, for the time I've been here, is how we handle adversity. Last year's team, there were a lot of adversity, and we handled it well, and especially with this year's team. I mean, as good as we are this year, we still see adversity, and there's still been games where we have to, have to handle ourselves and stay composed, and I feel like that's our, that's our best you know, characteristic as a team, as a whole. Is how we handle our adversity and come back and come back strong in the next game. I think, I think the biggest thing that changed is uh, getting getting the recru Johnson's recruits because uh, last year was Johnson's first year and a lot of the guys on the team weren't really his recruits, so he had to work with um, guys that weren't really he didn't know that well. Um, and compared to this year, I mean, a lot of the upperclassmen are still not his recruits, but. He knows how to work with those guys, and having his low underclassmen, his, my class and the freshman class are his guys. Um, he knows how to work with us, and that's one of the biggest differences I've seen is how how well we all work together this year. Uh, I mean, in any sports, you, the fans, especially at home, always have your back, and uh, it builds momentum. So having bigger crowds this year and more fans coming out as we keep winning, it's really built momentum for us. and. You know, we're really hot at home, and we love playing at home because of the atmosphere. And now that the weather's heating up and we got popular Piccoli going on, we're hoping to get a lot more sellouts and a lot more fans. Practice and practice overall, um, really not much change from last year in practice, but uh, I would say the biggest change is the tempo and the pace that we practice. And we have, we have a lot of guys, like our whole team, are willing to be out here, and everyone wants to be out here and have fun and work as a team. And... That's one of the best things that you can do is have a good practice because if you have a good practice, people want to be there. We knew, us in San Diego State, we were the two top teams in the Mountain West. So going into this weekend after a rough weekend in Fresno, uh, we knew that we had to be on our A game, especially against San, San Diego State. And um, we went in there with a lot of confidence. We, uh, we, were, we went in there and we were ready. We knew who we were facing, we knew who we were playing, and we felt good. We felt really confident about what we were going to do, and we stick to our approach. And, that's exactly what we did and came out with three wins, so that was really big. And after that big series win against San Diego State, the Wolfpack is now in sole possession of first place in the Mountain West, and they look to keep that going as they head into the postseason. Back to you guys. Thanks, Drake, for that insightful interview. It's good to get to know our Wolfpack athletes a little bit better and a glimpse inside our baseball team. Absolutely, and thank you all for watching our channel. If you liked it, go ahead and hit the like button or subscribe to our channel to keep up on all the Wolfpack news. And let us know what you thought in the comments. We'd love to hear from you. So from Drake Montez, I'm Alex Stewart. I'm Nick Coleman. And thank you for watching this episode of Inside the Pack.